there's two things making me upset. There's that and one other thing. What's the other? What's thing? the other? I hate water towers. Water towers? Water it towers? It doesn't make any sense. Like, why, why are water towers in the air? Like, the mayor's like, hey, we need to store the town's water. And they said, where should we store it? What is up, guys? Super Raccoon Bros here today. I am back for another video. And I'm here to check out the next SML movie video to catch up on. And this is called Junior's Crazy Assumption. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> What is he assuming now? But how does he assume it? I don't know, he just doesn't look into it. Maybe he does, but how he assumes it, it's just crazy. Oh my God. Before I begin, if some of you haven't seen this SML movie video, well, the original video link is in the description below for you to check it out. All right, are you ready? Let's uh, go. Uh, Joseph, I don't want to go to school today. Me either, dude. Well, what, what's that noise? At, at school. Hey, what's up, you friggin' twinks? Whoa, Cody, did you get a new bike? <laughs> yeah, what dude, my mom got it for me so I don't have to walk to school. Is that a fucking cat? I feel like it's distracting from my bike. Yeah, the cat. Uh, the cat. I, I think know. we should all focus on how cool going. my new bike is. He just, like, the cat. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Shut up with the cat. Yeah, look, kitty, kitty. Oh, oh look, at look at the kitty. It's a bell seat. But and look at the key. Oh, the cat's gone. Oh. Yeah, but my the cat. bike, though. Oh, oh yeah. What am I you talking got about? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> he just showed Joe, up. You see his bike? Yeah, dude. He just I took. Jumped in or something. Joe, did you stole your bike? I don't. I don't know what I was expecting. Well, I don't know why he thinks he can get away with that. We have to see him at school later. Well, mm. I guess I'll just walk to school with you. Come on, let's go. Okay. All right, class. Today we're gonna be learning how octopuses reproduce. When a male octopus finds a female octopus he wants to bang, he rips off his penis and literally pulls it out, and then he dies. So he literally dies for the pussy or octopusy. You know, Penelope, if I was an octopus, I would have already ripped off my wiener and threw it at you. Uh, Junior, I really that... don't know how to take that. How does that uh, make Joseph, sense? Where's my bike? <laughs> oh, I saw that shit. Oh. oh. Yeah, I had him equip but tight shit, tight shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Octopus. Hey, teacher, can I go to the bathroom? I eat too many Takis and now my butthole's on fire. Yes, Mori, mm, make tuckies. it quick. <laughs> See you later, chumps. I'm going to the bathroom, which means I'm skipping school. You coming too, mm. Penelope? I clean my room again. No, bully. I have a boyfriend now. <laughs> okay, just know my room is clean. What? Penelope, what does he mean by that, that his, that his room is clean? I don't know, Junior. Well, that's got to be some kind of inside joke between you two. <laughs> okay, well, Junior, before you okay, and I started guys. going out, I was seeing Bully, and there was one day I, mean, I was over yeah. at his house, and we were watching Seinfeld on the couch, and then we started making out, and that was it. You made out with Bully? Yeah, we made out, and then I left. That was it, Junior. And then the next day, he asked me if I was coming over, and I said no, and he said, but I clean my room for you. Why do you clean his room for you? I don't know. No, you have to know. What you have happened? to say that. There's got to be some kind of sick inside joke between you two. What? No, Junior. No, no, I, you that would be assuming. I think you were making out on the couch, and he wanted you to do something to his wiener, and you said, no, I won't do it in your room because your parents might see. And you said, why don't we go Whoa. to your room? And he goes, no, my room's too dirty. I don't want you to see my room dirty. And you're like, well, how about if you clean your room, then I'll do stuff to your wiener. And then he cleaned his room. Junior, you're being crazy. You know what? I got to go. My dad's hey, Cody, shipping me out just early because I have a doctor's listening to this, like, Bye. No, no. Cody, did you hear this? You hear this? I gotta take it. <laughs> Wait, why love this book? Bruh, that transition to when he's just, you know, looking depressed. Oh, wow. Oh, guys, I feel so much better after that doo doo. Wait, Junior, what's wrong? You look terrible. He said. Bully and Penelope made out. Well, didn't that happen before you guys even got together? Yeah, but he cleaned his room for her. See, I told you that whole was a thought. Thank you, huh? Joseph. Well, Junior, sometimes people do just clean their rooms. No, no guy would, would brag about cleaning his room to a girl unless it was he was going to get something out of it. No one just cleans their room for fun, okay? People mm. only clean their rooms when their parents yell at them or unless a girl promises <laughs> to bang you. Think about it. Penelope or and Bully were making money. out on his couch. And he wanted well, her to do stuff to his wiener. And she said, no, I don't want to do it in the living room. I want to go to your room to do it because I don't want your parents to see. And he said, no, my room's way too dirty. We, we can't go to my room. And then she said, how about this? If you clean your room, then I'll come over and I'll do stuff to your wiener. What? Junior, you're making a lot of assumptions. I mean, yeah, how there, dirty would there, his room there, have to be that is. he would turn down her doing stuff to his wiener? I mean, she, he would have to have pizza boxes stacked all the way to the ceiling. Like actual cat shit on his pillow. I'm talking corpses, Junior, for him to turn that down. I mean, yeah, his room would have to have been dirty. I, it just doesn't make any sense. Like, the first thing I do when I invite a friend over for the first time is show him my room. You know, I say, peep the room. Peep the bunk bed. Mm -hmm. Check out the room. Check the fit. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, <laughs> Is that how they host, say? Like, as soon as they went to his house, she, yeah, he said, we got to stay in the living room. room. We can't go to my room. Something's up, Cody. Something's up. There's two things making me upset. There's that and one other thing. 
What's the other? What's the other? I hate water towers. Water towers? Water it towers? It doesn't make any sense. Like, why, why are water towers in the air? Like, the mayor's like, hey, we need to store the town's water. And they said, where should we store it? Wait, that's goes, the second thing that's bothering, there, bothering you? Water towers? Yeah, that's where I want to store it. Not on the ground. I want to store it 50 feet in the air, so it's really hard to get to. I don't know much about, much about the meeting, but That's a water there, tower. there are water Wouldn't towers it be for a reason. Just to put this so whole I don't think much about that until now. So can get to it. But no, they say, let's put it 50 feet in the fucking air. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> suspicious, dude. Yeah, why? Like, the, the people aren't running around pillaging and destroying towns and poisoning water supplies. We don't have to do this anymore. We can just put the water right on the ground. This is like, I don't understand why it has to be so high in the air. Like, how'd they even get all that water up there? Dude, why? Water be, weighs so they'll, much. They'll go like, that's not that. the size of a I mean, it's not really rogue, what I'm saying. You know how heavy water is? Is that. Like, how the hell did they get You just have to do some research of what I, I, the I meaning of the water tower is. I, is. I mean, so there's two I things mean, I need to do for me, Cody. Maybe one day. I need to find out why water towers are in the air. Like, is that even smart to do that? But still, I need you to go. I already think about the assumption or the water tower. Because if he's bigger than me, I'm breaking up with Penelope. But if I'm bigger than him. Then, then I'll then I'll stay with her. Oh, okay, well I'm happy to do a little bit of research. Research. Well, go go get the pick. Oh yeah, I'll just make a Snapchat and pretend that I'm a girl. <laughs> Actually, hell, I could probably use my own. I'm pretty good at this. Mm. That's a weird request, dude. I need to know. Okay, Junior. I asked Billy for the wiener pick, but he hasn't sent it yet. But I did figure out the water tower thing. So apparently oh, they put did. the water up there so that gravity okay. naturally pulls the water down and creates water pressure so it goes through the pipes. Oh, die. Well, that's the answer. Oh, die. No, die today. That's so stupid. What a dumb answer. Right. Well, that's the answer. I'm sorry. No, you know, it's so stupid. You're telling Since me they put the water up there for it to come back down. Well, yeah, Real so they don't answer. have to build a pump. Yes, they do have to build a Sorry. pump. How do you think the water gets up there? They have to pump the water up answer. there. So they already have to build a pump. Well, okay. they only have to pump it once, and then gravity does the rest. No, how about you just put the water on the okay, ground, and then use the pump my, to pump the water uh, up to people? Or actually, I thought about but water towers. Then you have to have it constantly pumping. That just came up in this video. And then have gravity pull it back. <laughs> oh, okay. no, I bet it's constantly pumping water up there, because you know how much water is human, dude? Oh, hell, die. Shut up. I don't want to hear that anymore. I'm sorry, Junior. That's the answer. Why are we hearing more about water towers than about the assumption? Oh, he said it wouldn't send over Snapchat because the file was too big. He had to email it. Oh, it's in Dropbox. Oh, it's in a compressed zip file. Hold on. Oh, it's the zip that file big. is two terabytes? I can't download all that. My <laughs> iCloud storage is full. Junior, we're going to need another phone. Oh, okay, hold on. We'll use mine. Okay, let me see if we can put them together. No, Junior, that's still not the whole picture. Well, we're going to need an iPad. Okay, I have an Bro, iPad. Bro, they're big. It's so dramatic that it's oh big. My God. Oh, my God. Oh, sweet Jesus. Junior, that's just the tip. Junior, we're, we're gonna need a bigger screen. We have to go to the movie theater. We have to project this onto an IMAX screen. Yeah, let's go see, let's go see. Oh, okay, Junior, the movie theater employee dude. didn't want to put it on the screen, but I gave him $10, but he said he still might $10. lose his job, so it should be coming on any second. Well, he lost the job for $10. Oh my God, Junior. It's so massive. It's taking up the whole screen. Uh, I mean, he must have used Christopher Nolan's 35 millimeter IMAX camera to take this picture. That's an Oppenheimer cock. Oh God, Cody, he's right, huge. It's Edwards the biggest Godzilla thing I've ever seen. Scale. There's no way I can compete with that. Junior, it starts over there and it ends over there. And the worst part is something. we don't even see the balls. Who knows how far behind those are? Oh God, if she did anything with them, it's over. It's, it's completely <laughs> over. Oh Junior, oh, yeah, oh no, Junior, you better hope she did. Instantly die. Oh, oh my God, Junior, I, I think the projector just crashed. That's how big it was. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry, Junior. Damn. That was a huge dude? Oppenheimer cock. Oh, Oppenheimer. Damn. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, I have to leave her. I have to break up with her. No, you don't, oh, Junior. You bro. don't even know if she did anything. It's no. that big. It's huge. I have to break up with her. That's the bro. right thing to do, dude. Thanks, Joseph. Okay, Joseph. Well, I have to go, know. bro, but I think you know what to do. Wingman. I'm going to break up with her. I'm going to call her right now, tell her to come over. And I'm gonna tell her I just can't do this anymore. Oh, come on, Junior, don't do that. I have to. Oh. Hey, Junior! <gasps> Junior, what's wrong? He said... Oh, no, is it the water tower thing again? It just what? doesn't make sense. It Why asked, are they in the asked, air? Junior, I already explained before. this to you. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Nothing you can say makes it make sense. <laughs> Junior, you need to Bro. get over it. I think we should break up. What? Over the water tower thing? <laughs> no, over bully. What? 
I saw his penis. What? Junior, <laughs> what are you talking about? Cody asked him for a dick pic, and we tried looking at it, and it wouldn't load on a phone screen, so we had to go to a movie theater. Dude, that is such a weird answer. It's like, huge. Bro, so why you, you need to what, go be what's with the him. reason? He has a huge wiener. What? That's I'm not going to go be with Bully, Junior. He gets to have you. He wins. He gets to have me? Yes, he won the size contest. He's way the bigger than you. The size contest? So be with him. Be happier with him. <laughs> Junior, we're in, like, fifth grade. Why are we even talking about this kind of stuff? They're still in the fifth grade? Are they, like, in high school? Yeah, so right now? I'm growing to do. I'm not gonna get any bigger. I saw my dad get out of the shower. I've peaked. I, I'm not getting any bigger. Junior, this is ridiculous. What? I'm not gonna go be with Bully. There's nothing that happened between us. Oh, oh bull crap. I, if it's that big, you had to do something with it. If, it, if, if my thing was that big, I'd whip it out every chance I get. Junior, why don't you just ask him then? Because he's gonna lie. No, he won't. Okay. okay. You stay right here. I'll invite Bully over. And if he lies, you call him a liar straight to his face. Okay, fine. Okay. All right, yeah. I'm gonna get Bully. Uh, hey, what's up, Scrubs? Oh, you that's like my the bike. New bike. I just bought it earlier it today is. from your friend Joseph. Oh, okay. So that's where it went. Bully, I need to speak to you. Okay. So you sent a wiener pick to Cody earlier today, and your wiener's huge. Oh, that thing. <laughs> yeah, that's my favorite <laughs> practical joke I like to pull on people. The, I just find a random bag. wiener pick on Google Images, and then I just put that into Photoshop and set the dimensions to be as big as an IMAX screen. <laughs> it's hilarious. Oh, it so that's phones. not actually so his. That wasn't your wiener? No, man. We're in fifth grade. Why would I send a picture of my wiener to somebody? <laughs> <laughs> Well, you and Penelope made out on your couch, like, before she was dating me, right? Yeah. So why'd you clean your room for her? Oh, well, why? she wanted to go to my room to play Fortnite, but I said no because I pee in my bed a lot, and instead of changing the sheets, I just put newspaper on there, like in the movie Big Daddy. So then the next day, I told her that I cleaned my room, but she didn't want to come over. Oh, because of Fortnite? <laughs> so she's never done anything to your wiener? No, of course not, man. Nah, they fifth grade. You. Okay, yeah. Uh, uh, He's, I'm gonna go. he's not that wait, crazy. Wait, where the hell is my bike? Oh, no. Hey, get back here, dork! So, Junior, do you feel any better? No. Because the water, 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 What's with the water towers? Penelope and Junior had this conversation about water towers and why they're up in the air. So I guess I learned a little bit more about water towers. That's something I learned. But still, um, <laughs> SMO is just not out of its logic, but it's not going beyond it. Yeah, I really enjoyed the episode. It's so, it was so stupid, but I really enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, Junior just gets a little bit crazy with his assumptions. So I guess he learned a little bit, a little bit that things are not actually happening what they used to. I don't think he does that. That's not character development. It's kind of nice to see a little bit more of Junior and Penelope's relationship, even though it might have a fallout with how Junior wants to break up with her. First Junior, and he did it a second time, and then Penelope kind of warned him, and then happened, but got back together. So it's kind of an up and down kind of thing. All right, everyone, that is all I have to say in this video. If you want me to continue on catching up to uh, SML, please be sure to leave a like and a comment for the support. Subscribe with all notifications on so you do not miss any new videos coming up in my channel. Thank you for watching. Come back next time and see how.